champions. As you've seen, I'm out here with Harley again. And as usual, first thing on the agenda is to catch some bait. And Harley's been going on about how good this new electric is and it's doing the good to find the bait, I tell you what. Sneaking up on some big mullet here. And some little mullet too. You know, I love those liveys. This guy, he's a bit <laughs> Got big him. for livey around here anyway. Everybody. The plan is to throw all these mullet and maybe a few lures around the western mouth of the Anna Branch here on the Calliope River. The tide's running pretty hard today, but hey, we're gonna give it a crack anyway. Time to get out there and get a few baits in the water. Oh. There was one chasing him as well. Yeah, I've not caught a barracuda before, let alone one here. Yeah, don't let him get your toes. <laughs> Fair warning, I've not put my toes anywhere near well, the jaws on this guy. Oh. Don't show him at me. <laughs> See you, bud. No, it was only so long that one of these bloody things showed up. You know how I feel about estuary cod. Love eating them. I hate the little ones. I hate thieves, every one of them. Fish. Not a bad size, little pikey. I don't even... Whoa! Legal cod. Give it some... Be, I reckon he'll be legal. And he was with a minimum size of 38. This guy was into the low 40s. Luckily for this guy, nice we didn't bring ice, we just come out for a quick flick, so he's going back in. I'll get you another day, buddy. There we go. He's and that was about it from me and Harles. He had some prior engagements this afternoon, so we headed back to land. But tomorrow. track and out for the light heart and it's pretty muddy and pretty soft in some sections. The tides are building at the moment so we're gonna have to walk at least the last bit because we're going out through the mangroves to access the water and this thing it'll sink but we'll get as far as we can but we got to get out and hook it. Yeah so we would we were definitely sinking. See my marks here head on the sand this must be the night tide height, runs all the way up here into the trees. Wow, that's soft. Getting pretty close to where these trees are in the water. Harley and I sounded them out yesterday. They pulled some good fish off them last week, so we just gotta make it through the mangroves here. Shoeless now. Have a look at this. Go, there's the tree in the water. So we're in the right spot. Let's get some baits in. Don't go around that other line. I was chasing down here, but definitely a beautiful fish nonetheless. With these, I'll let him go anyway. It may not look like it, but he did swim off in the end. <sighs> what do we got this time? Another one. Now the challenge is to have your drag set just right so you can pull these things out of the sticks, but not get snapped off when they smash your bait. Little trav. Oh, he's off. That's alright. These uh, dead trees do hold a couple of fish. Oh, wouldn't mind getting something edible or oh, something I like to eat anyway. Hey, <laughs> good. Mosey. 
nice little mosey. I'd love to get an Eden size one one day. I've never eaten them before. This guy's way too small, so I'll send him home. Righto, guys, I want you to remember you can catch more of my content on all the socials, Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. Make sure you're subscribed on here. And uh, you can catch my Harley stuff, Fishless Fisherman. I believe they're on Instagram and YouTube. All right, guys, thanks for joining us. I'll see you next time.